place the heart with the ventral surface uppermost on the dissecting tray. If there is fat, carefully remove it and any lung or pericardial tissue to expose the external features. Much of the fat may be picked away, but if you use the scalpel, be careful with your fingers. Feel the walls of the ventricles and observe that the left ventricle is larger and has thicker walls. Observe the sulcus, which separates between the left side and the right side. Start the dissection with the right atrium and ventricle. Make an incision 1.5 cm to the left and parallel to the longitudinal sulcus, from the pulmonary artery to the base of the right ventricle. Make a second incision from the right atrium down to the base of the ventricle to meet the initial incision. Lift up the triangle wedge of muscle. Very carefully clear any clotted blood from the chambers of the heart and the roots of the blood vessels. Take great care not to damage the valves and the cardiotendony. Dissect the left atrium and ventricle. Now open the left side of the heart by making an incision about 1.5 cm to the right and approximately parallel to the longitudinal sulcus from the left atrium down to the base of the left ventricle. Remove any clotted blood as before. Bend back to expose the internal structures of the right side and bend back the wall of the left ventricle.